John O'Sullivan farming just outside Kinsale, about two miles outside Kinsale. We're milking about 320 cows in a predominantly spring calving, tight calving system uh, with about 520 kilos of milk solids. Roughly about 160 hectares in total, of which about 82 is on the milking platform. And the vast majority of the herd <coughs> is pedigree Frisian, registered under, under the Tessassin prefix. We've bred a few bulls into AOE with the last few years. The Tessassin Troopers, currently the the top bull, I think, on the active bull list. There's also a few pedigree jerseys and a small few crossbreds, but the herd is now pretty much all, all Frisian with a small bit of sexy use for the jerseys. The biggest change I've made to the farm in recent times is purchasing the True Test heat detection and health collars from uh, Datamars. The reason I did it was to try and free myself up a bit in the spring, just trying to save you money, but also make you money. I suppose you were tied to the place, especially during the, the, the breeding season. I do all my own AI, but at the same time you are still toy tail painting, every milking you were tail painting. I used to bring in sweeper bulls after maybe six weeks AI, so I've got rid of the bulls. Look, it certainly has worked very well so far. At the moment, this time of year, there's just logging heats for when I start breeding at the end of April. I suppose it's also taken the need for pre-breeding heat detection out of it, which means I can get in my scanner before breeding as opposed to waiting for three weeks into breeding. And obviously then you have the health, the health side of it, you'll have that for, for 12 months of the year. I mean, look, it's like, it's like another labour unit around the place really. It seems to be very, very accurate. Look, it's catching as much the silent heats. Maybe the cows that you're 50-50 both, whether, whether it's, it's, it's bringing everything. It, it's also giving you accurate times. So I, I plan on using a lot of six semen this year. And it's giving you that, that optimum window to breed before you're just going off tail paint and you're wondering, is it enough it removed? You're guessing what time did you start? No, well, if it's one o'clock in the morning, it's telling me what time it started. So whether it's air in the morning or air in the evening. The main reason as was well as wearing for the data mouse collars is to save on labour and just the reliability of knowing every cow is on the same system will be picked up with the same parameters. Look, hopefully that should improve the conception rates and especially as well as the six week conception rate. I've never quite hit 90% of models, maybe 80% plus, but there's certainly less excuses now to not hit the 90%. The app is very good and the system in general. The app is was well, it's basic, but it's still giving what you what what you need. Any code that's in heat at the moment is just being pinged. You, you just see the, the yellow dot in the morning first thing up on top of your phone, with, and then you, when you log in, you can see the codes um, and what time they started. It's not over complicated. If you want if, if you want to do more detail, you probably go into the laptop or the computer. There's more than that, but the app the app on the phone is very good too. It's very very simple to, to use. On a couple of occasions that you know, that I've had to contact customer support, they've been quick. The problem has been solved very very efficiently. It's been excellent to be honest. So couldn't, couldn't fault it anyway. I suppose the reason for going with, with the data mouse collars, I suppose look, they're a reliable company, they're there with years in the, in the whole tag business. The two test is, is in New Zealand and, and a lot of the bigger herds around the world with, with, with a long time. So the reliability is there. You know if it succeeds in the markets, then it's going to succeed here. My reason for purchasing as but data mouse is look, I suppose they're, they're building a whole ecosystem around livestock management, farm management. They've been in the market for they have a, lot, a track record for a lot of years behind them. It, it might seem new for this with this technology, but it's, it, it's not it's not worldwide. Look, that, that, that was very, very reassuring. The big thing is work-life balance. Six o'clock in the evening, closing the gap after the cows, but you weren't finished. You, you know, you were doing, still doing a, a pre-dusk check as well in the cows. And um, look, no, take the kids to a match, or even if you're going away for a wedding or something, you're going away, you're not, you know it's still being looked after. And you know the following morning, or if, if there's someone else milking the cows, that the exact same eyes looking at them the whole time, um, and that they're, they're going to be done, done as if you were there yourself. So look, it certainly has been a huge labour saving day with that way.